Yes, entertainment. And we're back together again. Yes, yes, it's me, Shelda Smith of Shelly Yes Entertainment. Welcome to Simba NYC TV from out of Brooklyn, New York. Oh my gosh. I just want to really just thank the viewers for commenting, subscribing, and sharing. Thank you so much, and please continue to do so. Tell your friends all about us. We have a great show planned for you. As usual, we have the Book Talk Health Corner, and we have Get Straight. Uh, you don't want to miss what's happening between Gabby and Deborah. You don't want to miss this. And so we're ready, we're ready with this show. We have a great artist, and his name is Mighty Flex, and he is in the building. And we're about to have some great music. Don't go anywhere. Don't touch that dial. We'll be right back. And we're back. And I'm sitting here with Mighty Flex. Yes. Welcome to Simba NYC TV. Oh, thank you very much. So what I'm going to do now is, I just want you to introduce yourself, tell my viewers a little bit about your background. Yeah, well, this is Mighty Flex, reggae artist from Grenada, from a small village, Davi. Well, my music really is just, as I'll tell anybody, love and fire. So you're going to get straight love and fire from Mighty Flex. We like that. Love and fire. We like that. Yeah, so so how, how did you get started in, in the business? I mean, ever since I was a little kid, mm -hmm. uh, I kind of liked music. I was always singing. Yes. It was always my thing, singing. I used to always wake up in the morning singing. Did you play an instrument? No, never really played an instrument. Okay, just singing. Yeah, just love melodies and yeah. Yeah, just sing. So when did you know that you wanted to make this a career? I mean, I always liked it, but I mean, when I was like about a, a growing up, like say, teenager, mm -hmm. Garnet Silk, mm -hmm. yeah, he gave me that inspiration, made me realize that you could you, you could sing that music, mm -hmm. yeah, because I always used to be singing and because I always liked reggae music, mm -hmm. always, mm -hmm. even when I was really listening to Sparrow and. And all the kitchen and all them other old singers. Mm -hmm. I used to still listen to my Bob, my Dennis Brown, mm -hmm. you know, my yes. Gregory, mm -hmm. my Jacob. I still used to listen to them, you know. Mm -hmm. Two seven meters. I love them then. So love those them. people were your influences. Yeah. I mean you, you don't mind jamming to a little soca. Nah. But nah. reggae is is reggae is, is one just, yeah. 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 It's, it's yeah, a hard yeah, thing. Yeah, it's, yeah, it's a hard <laughs> thing. It's a hard thing. You know, for me, I describe your music, and if I'm wrong, you stop me. I describe your music as conscious dance hall. Yeah, you can say that. Mm -hmm. You can say that. Really with the culture. Yeah. 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 You can say that. And, and what I'm seeing is, I'm seeing a revival of conscious dance hall. Uh, I'm thinking in terms of chronics, I'm thinking in terms of prodigy, I'm, th I'm thinking in terms of those two artists, and there, there are others. Chronics, how he describes his his style is, he's a Rasta meaning hipster, and, and Protégé says he's traditional roots with a little hip hop and a little rock and roll. Um, what is your style in terms of, of, of conscious dance hall? I would say that little dance hall flavor but I still got a little rocky because it's used for rock reggae. Mm -hmm. If it's not reggae, you can't have the rock. But I'm more of that conscious, nice, sweet music. Mm -hmm. Really. Mm -hmm. I would sing any genre of music. Yes. Yeah, you play a little classic for me, I'm going to find a little melody too. Mm -hmm. You play like a rock and roll for me now, I'm going to find a little melody too. Mm -hmm. And sing a song too. Mm -hmm. So I would say my music is 
worldly, worldly reggae music. Yes, in, in reggae international, music that, international. Yeah, international that you can you can embrace, mm -hmm. get that nice flavor, flavor for anybody. Your song, Wanted, I'm, I'm interested to in know what was the inspiration for that song? Oh, see that? I'm so into that worldly music. Mm -hmm. There is, you got class, they have this thing in society, you got class, you got the poor class, mm -hmm. you know, you got the upper class. I almost see the poor class yes. because it's like there's so much things going on around that people are not really paying attention to with all these other things going on. So mm -hmm. yes. the music is, I was actually walking one day going to work. Mm -hmm. Walking, going to work and just looking around, getting a little vibe and just got inspired. Mm -hmm. Seeing certain little things, little street vendor, seeing people hustling and bustling around. Yes. That's, that's a poor just, class. Just, that's just, a, yeah, just moving about, trying to get the thing, yeah. uh, get the people wanted. Yeah. Yeah. Clothes and food and everything. Same thing. Mm -hmm. That's here for everybody. Yeah, they want it to. So then what do you know what we're gonna do? We're going to take a look at the video. Want it. Mm -hmm. And then we'll be right back with more Mighty Flex. Stay tuned. To see if you can do something about that. What about get some people? Hungry too. Now get some people that must suffocate. Babylon has smothered them. Poor people that must suffocate. Babylon has smothered them. Get some people want it. Clothes and food and everything. Now get some people want it. Do you also can you not say we want better living? Poor people want it, clothes and food and everything. Now get some people want it. Do you also can you not say we want better living? Mm. More vibes, poor mates, people them in hell. States of emergency. Now this is urgency. Governments and world leaders, the people they need you. I know say we need you So most time we need you Cause operation it continue Get the people want live good Want earn something too Yes they want it Clothes and food and Everything Now get the people want it We also can you know say we want Better living What people want it Clothes and food and Everything Now get the people want it do you also can you know several pants? Mm. Hey. I feel about the fire when me sing. I feel about the fire when me sing. Hey. I feel about the fire when me sing. Cause them your fire not ignite up your ceiling. Because it must be wicked and bloodthirsty. Son of me things, they might put me where the earth is. But the most I love it. Sign to wicked them. I poor people that suffer so work and nothing them not hurt me. I'm blind judgment and rats for poor people. See me no life what's a gone. I'm Babylon judgment and rats for poor people. Make him judgment and I get so people want it. Close and full and everything. Now get so people want it. Do you also can you know say we want better living? Poor people want it. Close and full and everything. I get the people fun. Do you also can you know some fans? Suffocate, Babylon has smothered them. For people, they must suffocate. Babylon has smothered them. And we're back. <laughs> yeah, man. Ghetto people. We're what? just in the vibes. <laughs> what about ghetto people? <laughs> yes, I'm hungry too. I'm hungry too. What about the poor people? Yes, I'm hungry too. Mm. Hungry too. No, mm. that too. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. That's the kind of you know. That's the kind of music we want. You know what I like about the music is 
it, it's got hope, it's got comfort, but it still have energy and still joy. Yeah, you know? Just just because, you know, you're poor, everything doesn't have to be like, even the music has to be like, uh, mm -hmm. keeping no, you no. depressed. And, so it's got hope in your song, the lyrics, it's got comfort, it have joy, but it still have energy. Yeah, you have to. I think I just described conscious dance hall. You probably do. I think I just described it. Yeah, you probably do. You know what I'm I'm wondering in terms of conscious dance hall. Now we're seeing a revival of it. Do you think it's going to last? Because you know the other dance hall, the the other I was gonna say the word reckless, but I don't use that word. But the other dance hall has taken over, it's larger, it's bigger, it's got a uh, do you think that this conscious dance hall is going is it's gonna last? Of course. It's gonna I love it I just like me. I like they say artists like Prodigy and mm -hmm. artists like Chronix. Mm -hmm. It's gonna be there. Because these these people will always keep coming. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Reggae music gonna be it starts with reggae music. Mm -hmm. Then dance all came from there. But that that's just a wave. Because mm -hmm. the new dance hall trend always changes. So you never know. Maybe it would change to just conscious. Would it have been easier to become more mainstream singing that dance hall or holding on to, to the need to continue to be conscious in terms of the music? I wouldn't say that, you know. I wouldn't say that because I've been asked many times mm. to take that trend. But it's all about what you really want to do and how you feel about it. It's your passion towards it. Mm -hmm. Because even if you sing in a conscious dance hall, you still could get the ears of the people to make them understand because that conscious dance is more that reality of life. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Everybody living in that reality. So mm -hmm. conscious dance alone always be there. That's why you see the, the reckless dancer always gotta keep changing. Mm -hmm. I never thought about yeah, that. They always gotta keep changing when the conscious one is like they keep backing with the conscious one is going to be steady. But Biggest reggae, reggae artist you ever think of. Mm -hmm. Look how long you've been there. You still there, you still even learning from that. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So you know, it's, it's gonna be there. Yes. Yeah, it's gonna be there. You know, when you first introduced yourself, you said you were a Dominican artist. <laughs> I'm sorry, Dominican artist singing reggae. I really want to know, and, I, and I've asked this about the artists who. Uh, not Jamaican reggae artists. They're not born in Jamaica, but they born, they're born outside of Jamaica and singing reggae. What are some of the challenges that you've encountered um, uh, trying to get to be known as a reggae artist? No label, not a Grenadian reggae artist, but just a reggae artist. It's not really a challenge. It's a, it's a matter of how a concept. I didn't understand it's a concept of how you present music mm -hmm. to the people. To me, reggae music has a language. It has a language mm -hmm. that you gotta, you gotta get into. Once you get that language, people, everybody gonna understand it. So it's like, I, I kind of take that, that kind of route, present it, so. When you say a language, I, I'm interested. Okay, what, do you, what do you mean? You see like how they got the dance hall. Mm -hmm. That's a language. Like, there are certain things that comes with that music. You see that conscious music? There's mm -hmm. one thing that comes with that music. There's only one thing that comes with conscious music to me. Mm -hmm. It's a conscious which everybody has, in spite of... Everybody has that consciousness. Mm -hmm. So it's easier. Mm -hmm. okay. And speaking of consciousness, I think we're gonna look at your next video. And I, I, I when I saw this video, I was like, yeah. So we got to look at the video. But before we do that, I want you to tell me what inspired you to write that song. Oh, it was a friend of mine that mm -hmm. passed away. And I sang that song. That song is written for him. But some of, I think that will incorporate some of the, yeah. to make it to, to that everybody can understand. I like that. What, you, what you've done in that song for me is you've honored um, legends in, in, in the reggae music business, 
and you brought them, brought it forward so that new people, young people who've never even heard of them, um, can know who they are. And, and that's what I that's what I got from the song. My friend gave me that. Yeah. In my book, he's a legend to me. Yeah. So we're gonna look at the song, and the name of the song is. You're not gone. Yeah, dedicated to my virgin Kalanji. Okay. Bob in a gun, Peter in a gun, Kalanji in a gun, no way. Dennis in a gun, Garnet in a gun, no way. How could it be a gun? You just left in a gun. Bob Marley, hey Peter, where you there? Gun, you just left in a gun. To your fans and your family. How could it be a gun? You just left in a gun. Dennis and Garnet, where you there? Gun, you just left in a gun. To your fans and your family. We just wanna know, sir. We just gone in the place. See life over death. And the most I live it. So just go and take that breath. Can the breath of life from the most I sustain it. And I know the people that still suffer it. And some are crying tears. Wonder what it would be if man was still flesh and dead. Them say you're gone, you just left, you know, God. But my leg, a pizza, where you there? Can you just left, you know, God? To your fans and your family How could it be a gun you just left in a gun? Mm -hmm. Then it's a gun until you're dead Gun you just left in a gun To your fans and your family Yeah, I just done chili and me Money to the slip tail of ice in my bed chin day You see my chest, that's my friend Make me a vine from your mates Pizza bonnet in a bucking and palace Landy bring the coachy come who make me feel like me could have all put it in a church mm. Them say you gone, you just left, you know God But my leg, hey pizza, where you there? Gone, you just left, you know God To your fans and your family How could it be a gone, you just left, you know God Ladies mm. and gone, it's a you there Gone, you just left, you know God To your fans and your family Yeah Have you ever lost someone you know? Just want to not say, we love you Have you ever lost someone you know? Real friendship, we love We just want to not say, we love you And if you're gone, you're not left Just gone in the flesh Gone until I'm there with it again So just go and take that bet It's destined to be released All of your stress and your shit You don't know You want to hide something from a Negro, put it in a book. seeking love. I came to the crowd for understanding. I found you. I came to the crowd to weep. I came to the crowd to laugh. You dried my tears. You shared my happiness. I went from the crowd seeking you. I went from the crowd seeking me. I went from the crowd forever and you came to the name of the poem is you came to and this is the work of Nikki Giovanni a poet a commentator an activist an educator her work ranges from race to social issues 
a literary giant. Please read the works of Nikki Giovanni. Thank you so much for joining me on Book Talk, and I'll see you next week. Bye. You want to hide something from a Negro? Put it in a book. Prevention is better than a cure. Health Corner. Welcome to Health Corner. It is the season for one of my favorite fruit, mangoes. They taste so good, but people forget that they are also healthy for you. It prevents cancer, it's an antioxidant. The components have been found to protect against cancer. Mangoes, they even lower cholesterol. And they also alkalize the whole skin. There are acids that are found in the fruit that help to maintain an alkali reserve. And mangoes even help with diabetes. It helps to normalize the insulin levels in the body. So beyond that sweet, luscious taste of the mango, think of the health benefits with every bite. And I'll see you next week on Health Corner. Prevention is better than a cure. Health Corner. because I didn't want to worry you and make a big deal about it. But yesterday, uh -huh. that Shami, she made one sort of back and now. What back and now are you talking about, baby? What she do? Shami, call up my mother and tell my mother how you don't have no green card and you're a womanizer. What? Wait. What? Like Shaman know me? What? 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 
she says she got it from a good source some guy who know you and play pan with you and come up on the same flight and he know everything about you oh. so what she say well I don't know if you know him but it's somebody she does lying with sound like a man who outside a, a kind of a party guy and how this guy know you real good and so she said the information is real good information oh <laughs> You know what? I think I know who she's talking about, you know. Belio, wait, wait did she say? Wait did she say? He say? Wait did she say? He say how he tell Charmaine that you don't have no green card and that's the reason you rushing to get married to me. What? And he also tell her that you that you are not a true member and to warn me that you are a womanizer you like a lot of women you know the more you talk about this person and the more you talk about this you know I, I, I feel I know I ain't feel now I, I know who that is you know I know who that is but, but here what it is going on I ain't go beat up you understand I ain't go beat up and I ain't go cause nothing you understand? Because you see them people and them, them is just pure haters. Them is just pure hate and abnormal. Them is just haters. You understand? <laughs> so it's that what you hear there and you're feeling down so? Yeah, because she called my mother. Oh God. But you know what? Yeah. I call her up. Yeah. You call she? Yeah, of course she. And I give it to her, Gabby. Yes, you push in she place. I check she left, right, and center. You damn right. I hope you give it to she good. You understand? She know me from no way, boy. And she plays she going and talking and bumping up she gum about me, boy. You understand? And the more you talk about this, you understand? I know who it is, you know. I sure I know who it is. But I'm worrying about them. Because I will meet up with them sooner or later. It's only a matter of time. You understand? I know. We just get rid of my mother. <laughs> and now shaving. Oh God. <laughs> Plan them wicked and evil boy. I done with Charmaine. Gabby, you don't even know how much thing I do for Charmaine. I done. I tell her to lose my number and do not call me back again. I done. I done. You see? When it's in one thing is the next thing I give. Family or no family, I done. Well, I ain't getting her as you know. Because I see the heart of the battle, the sweet of the victory. You understand? And none of them at all the bad mind thing. And wickedness can't come between this love with me and you have. So let me talk about something else now. How things going, baby? Well, girl, I just hear you, you know, trying to handle my scene and thing. I trying to see how it is like a damn next gig now, girl. You know what I mean? Because, you know, just now we're going to handle this scene. And as a man would be able to pull my weight now. You understand? So I trying to get something else to do so that, you know, I could be able to make my contribution in the whole marriage and the whole union now. It would be no dependent on nobody now. You know what I mean? I know. Because there are some sticks in the fire where it is are trying to start some things, you know, as far as we can think. And don't worry about nothing, man. I go make sure and do my part and everything will be alright. And you see them flicking, stinking, bad mind people and them? Eh, they even study them, eh? And I, and I know who it is to tell you all of them things Because I know it's only a matter of time Before I run into them I will run into them just now Yeah Every time I think about it The more I think about it I know who this is I know, I know for sure who this is You know the guy, Gary? Yeah I know who it is 
For sure. Eh? Is that stink mouth stuttering mother condensed milk? You don't know. It had to be he go and tell she all this that thing about me and this and that, but he's a hater. Because here it is going on. He and she tied from long time. You understand? And if there's anybody who come up with me with any flight, it had to be he. You understand? There's a bunch of other them too, but most of them who ain't going back, going to other state and all kind of things. So it had to be he like me, like New York. You understand? He like a little wandering Jew, bouncing from pillar to post. He always all over the place. Gabby, I know him? You can't remember when he was on the boat, right? See? It had a fella. You understand? With a whole row of gold teeth on the top of his mouth. You understand? He always have one of shades. Seen? Die saddest. And he just stutter plenty. Every minute he just stutter in plenty. Yeah, you must know him. You understand? Like plenty bossy and up in front, front and thing like the front of his cell and thing like he's a big dan and thing. Like them kind of thing. You must know him if you see him. So, so Gabby, what do you have with you? Why, why he don't like you? Girl, I'm tell you something. Me, no, nah. You understand, but all day, it are plenty of them who don't like me for whatever reason. But me in business, me like them neither. You understand? As long as they stay out of my way and they don't mind the flicking business, you understand? That's all I concern about. But anyhow, here it is going on. See? Just now, I'm going to come down by you. Right now, I'm just waiting for Nicholas Day. You understand? The reason on a little scene. And after that, I'm looking to come down by you. All right, baby, I'll wait till you know. Benio, baby, see, I'll go see you just now, right? All right. I love you. Love you too, baby. What blasted water rate are you talking about? What's up playing up in the house, you know? Me and Eileen play this bill last month. And next water rate again? I have two dollars on this card. I'm going to call my father and tell him what kind of madness is going on with these people and him from in the Spaniard. Hmm? So they send him a son move, yes? Look, me not telling me this bullet. I'm calling me here now this time of the day. What look like it's this boy. Hello? Hello, Daddy. What now? Daddy boy, you know Sadis? Who Sadis? Boy, there are like 20 different Sadis up here alone. Who Sadis you talking about? You can't remember that stink mouth stuttering one? From in the panyard? Who that played the double seconds? Who that be skating right you? And he had the most of that gallery behind the pan when he played. Yeah, 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 yeah. I know what you're talking about now. Yeah, 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 yeah. When you said I'm going to tell him out, Daddy, that man trying to mash up my scene, boy, Daddy, boy. But wait, but, but, but what do you mean? You only don't lie, man, think together. It's not like your partner. What is going on? Yeah, what is going on? You see, he, he and, and Deborah cousin, a girl named Shaman, both of them tight. They're real tight. So what end up going on now is like he might be coming in town or whatever it is or he and she might be talking or whatever it is and he tells she about all my business now about how I come up and thing and that um me not no green card all of me come up on the same flight and all kind of thing and that I try to rush his she, she cousin to the marriage tree and all kind of scene boy daddy boy look boy what wrong with you? You know nothing to worry about? And the girl don't know that already? So where are you fussing up and, and, and thinking up yourself so far? You see? You see how things as work? You see? I hope you see now. Huh? Because you remember the telephone Jump Street? Let the girl know where it is going on. You understand? You see how it come and it come full circle now? You see how it come and it come and it play itself now? That is what I'm talking about. That is what I tell you from in the jump.
Let the girl know where it is going on. You see how this man come here now to, 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 to put, put, put spoke in your wheel? Huh? Yeah, boy, daddy, boy. It's true. You didn't really know where you were saying when you tell to tell she the, the, the truth, you know, and be straight up with she. You understand? And because of that, that is why right now, you're right about that. Me really have nothing to worry about because she know. But it's just, you know, when people get in your business now, boy, daddy, boy. You understand? Don't study that. She don't know already. And it's a good thing you tell she from jump what is going on. You understand? Now this stinking dirty bad mind boy come along here to, 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 to mash up your scene. You understand? Don't study them though. That is how they is. You understand? It's a real life company. That is how they is. Don't study them. Them is jumpy. You understand? You just keep on holding your head and doing what they had to do. You understand? Don't study them jumpy and then. Them is jumpy. Hmm. Yeah, boy, daddy, but I'm really glad I called you, yeah, boy. You understand? Right now, I'm feeling much better. You understand? And you are with mommy. Well, you know your mother already. She going on an excursion. Yeah, she going on an excursion to Blantishers with the church. Huh? Yeah? She tried to get me to go, but you know me neighbor with that. <laughs> me neighbor with that at all. Yeah? Yeah, she go and let them jump up in the bus and thing and have a time up in black, she says. You understand? So, boy, you remember what I'm telling you? Don't study them fool and them. Them in born them just some stinking, dirty, bad mind people who ain't want to see you reach no way. They just jumpy. Remember I tell you that thing, they jumpy. You understand? And just stay away from around them and do what it is they have to do, you yeah? Let them flicking blight and them come and 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 and, and put no spoke in your wheel or no tack in your rice and no. Oh, yeah, boy, daddy, boy. You know what you're saying. You know I think thinking about that ain't you, boy. It's a good thing I already did tell she was this scene from jump, yes. You know. But anyhow, I just wanted to call you. I ain't have much time on this guy. You know we go already. I just wanted to call you and let you know where's this scene now. You understand? Tell mommy I love she and um, I'll call back in the week. Right? Well, all right, boy. You, you, you take it easier. Eh? And remember what I tell you. Don't study them fool and them, boy. They jumpy. Eh? <laughs> all right, boy. Later. All right. Later. The boy going good, 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 good all the time, no? This blasted boy going on as anybody. I mean, you really know what she'd be saying when she go there. Eh? I guess she's still in the chair. I can't blame she. Can't blame she at all in this time. Eh? People, people are nice, man. People are nice at all. I let a stinking little boy there. I used to be seeing him in the panyard. Trying to put spoke in my boy. I used to see him in there. Yeah, uh, it's ten people. Wait. Daddy was right. It is the other way. Because she don't know the truth. So people are nice. Suppose I don't really do not tell. She not meant you, right? Oh, 
about blank. I call you Ross, don't call you in accent. How come you not here now? Paul! Paul, you here? Yes, Uncle Matt. Where this boy with my rent, man? Where you friend? Where you friend? In fact, the same boy you bring down inside of here. Where you, where you friend? Man, Uncle. He was just here, man. You sure you're not inside here? Knock again, man. He was just here, Uncle. He was just, just here. I can't believe you, you see. Him. Get off me! It's Mr. Matt. He's not there. I call you, Ross. Uh, so far, you're not, you're not seeing me for. Uncle, I'm telling you, man. You must have just missed him. He was just inside your room there, man. I just, just see he there. I can't understand how you ain't seen me now. Listen, let me tell you something. This is you friend, you know. You understand what you're saying? Every week I gotta be worrying about my rent money. I sick and tired of the raw so foolishness now. Alright? Get somebody who working and got a job and everything and ready to pay you raw so rent. Or else don't bring nobody else here. You hear what you're saying? When they gonna get me cruel, raw so you know? When they gonna get me cruel? I want my money when the week come. Paul, Paul. I wash my raw so on, you know. Me got nothing to say again to defend here again, you know. I don't know what again to do. I get here a job, you know, Uncle. Uncle Matt, I get the man a job with Miss Priscilla. You know Miss Priscilla? I know Priscilla, man. She from, from, from McDougal. She got a house there. She just get a brand new house or something like that. We... Uncle? All I can tell you is that I get a job for Garvey. I tell Garvey, go and do the job. Garvey started complaining and tell me about the job too big and the woman ain't paying enough money and all kind of raw, so foolishness. Bare excuse, he don't want work. And guess what? It's only 10 she that she brought the woman what he put up. I give you a job, he don't want it. So, you gotta do what you gotta do. Then she the chick rock. You can do that in five minutes, man. So wait, what you trying to tell me? He ain't tell you what? He tell me the job is too much of a big job for the little bit of money that they want to get he. And he ain't tell you work. You understand? I don't know if he got another job or sign. Like he working somewhere else or sign. I don't know. I know he gave he a job he didn't want it. He ain't tell the rock so work. And he still ain't paying me my rock so right. Or oh, well, he's a Johnny or what? That is you, uh, so funny, you know. That is your friend. And if you see, I gotta be going through this again for one more week. I gonna have a baby, I'm gonna tell you, you gotta let out of my place. But I'm not going through the draw so foolishness. There's too much of foolishness to be going through. You know what I'm saying? So tell your friend, if you can't get my rent money, it's better he left out of my place. You understand what he's saying? Raw so it is. That is, that my money. Bring my money. I sit and tired of the police just now. That's a really special song because I, I think what that song does, it honors those who've laid the blueprint, so to speak, um, for upcoming artists. Yeah, so yeah. I, I really, really enjoy that song. And to me, the names that are called in that song, mm -hmm. these were more, mostly my influence in the music. Okay. It's Dennis Brown, Garnet, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Bob. But that song really, that song was me just dedicating it to my to my friend really. To me it's like real near and dear to me. Yes. He was one of the first person. After people get to find out that I really sing regular music, he was one of the people that came to me and told me, Flex, 
Jamaica ain't it for God. Okay. Yo, that's the music people need to hear. Mm. Your type of vibes. Yeah. Yeah. So he, and he was always used to be. You need to come to me and come and see them and mm -hmm. put things together. Mm -hmm. He was actually a, a selector. Yes. So he, he was instrumental in you going forward. He would push you and yeah, come. Yeah, he, he was that kind of. Yes. So in spite of everybody else who, who was around me, he was one of the people that just yeah. came to me and just took me one time. Like, so this, 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 is, is, this is really a, kind of an interesting song. The song is about him. Um, and it's also about them. And, and yeah. It's sort of like come full circle. The yeah. people who, including yes. him, yes. The people who, who influenced you. Yeah. I no, that's not that's, that. that's where that, you, everything yeah. comes. That is yeah. cool. That is everything that's a cool together. song. Yeah. Yeah. I like that song a lot. Comes yeah. Yeah. So I, I'm also you know I'm also always interested in names and and especially what an artist chooses to call himself or to be known by. Um, Tell me about your name, Mighty Flex. Well, the Mighty came way down after the Mighty, but Flex, it's kind of interesting the way I got that name too. I had to, for the first time I ever mm -hmm. performed, first time I ever had to perform on a stage. It was a, it was a St. Patrick's Day. It's a celebration yeah, in Grenada. Mm -hmm. I got, me and the next friend of mine got invited to perform because he used to sing up, like I told you, he always used to sing. Mm -hmm. So, two people heard about it, got in, invited to perform. And the MC mm -hmm. asked me, what's your stage name? I never really had a stage name at the time. <laughs> I was a skinny guy, you can see now. So I just said, flex. <laughs> just like yeah, that. That's it. <laughs> that's it. But the mighty, the mighty now came along. Later on, there was a song that I sing with some rap rapper friends of mine. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and then one day he came to me and he told me that his mom listened to the song and she was she told him who's that guy that's sitting there? Mm -hmm. She said there's something about that voice. And he said to me, he said, you, you never ever seen your mom two kids to a song and even ask mm -hmm. her mm -hmm. because he's Haitian. Mm -hmm. And his mom is Haitian. So after that he came to see so from now on you mighty! <laughs> because like everyone that hear that part, that's yes. the part they kind of take into. So you see from now on, you're mighty. Okay? And it was, that and was the name from then on. Mighty Flex. Mm. That is so cool. Yeah. I'm just, mighty Flex, you know, he's given us fire. Those two songs, they've been fire. But I just found out that he has a softer side. That he's, gonna, he's about also some love. Yeah. And you have a new project that you're working on? Yeah, I got this new project, yeah. me and Biggs. Yes. That used, used to be I up there, road manager. I got this new project with uh, the scientist, Skyboy, mm -hmm. a producer from Grenada. Yeah, we got a couple artists on the project too. And mm -hmm. also got a song on the project. Mm -hmm. A song called Turn Me On. Turn Me On? Yeah. Ooh, that's for the ladies. Yeah, that, that, that's for the ladies, yeah. <laughs> You know, it's not really for the ladies, it's for everybody. Oh, you know, it's for everybody. Oh. It's for the men, you know, it's for, it's for the women. Oh, it's one of those yeah, songs. It's one of those songs, you know? <laughs> okay. Yeah. It's one of those songs a man could sing for his woman, a woman could sing for his okay. man. It's just an understanding of it. Well, uh, Mighty Flex turned me on. <laughs> yeah, just it's expression. Yeah. Oh, 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 that's what it is. Oh, no, I, 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 I got it's, carried it's, away. No, no, no. That's okay. I got it's carried good. away. It's good. It's, that's what the song is about, though. As long as you can express yourself in that way, it's, it's good. It's good. Okay. It's good. It's just it's expression. So, well, you know what? Is is This song is already, it's it's out? Yeah, it's out. Yeah, okay. We can do it. And you don't have a video, a video no, to follow. The video is a follow. Alright, so we kind of getting we having a bit of an exclusive here. Yeah, yeah. This one is, is really okay. yeah, it's really okay. for people. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna listen to the song, Turn Me On. Yeah. And we'll be right back. Woo! It's getting hot in here. <laughs> hmm. Channel Skype on. You'll check for that girl, you know. Yo Biggs, she you know. Mm -hmm. Sight so coming from a distance, here there. We chat a little bit, see? 
Let me see you, I'm it like me flying Me water from a pipeline For more than a lifetime I'll be loving you You're brightening up my life Sun and shine, just bless this love Yeah, I hurt my search and now I find you mm. Woman yet turn me on Just be closer Yes, you turn me on You make me want you for You turn me on Drop me closer Woman, you turn me on mm-hmm. So keep me close to your heart Got me keep you close in my heart too And it won't be too far I will only turn on, but I'm turned up <laughs> You can chant, you can sing, smooth, I mean... Yeah, like I said. That's a lady song. That's right. I'm speaking on behalf of the ladies. That's the song. You have, you have to do something for the ladies. The ladies are very important. You gotta be a part of everything. I, I, I know we're gonna ask this. Could I be in the video? <laughs> of course. <laughs> of course. Of course. Now, my Simba and my CTV viewers, they don't forget things. You, did you hear what he said? I could be in the video. You're, you're going to see it in the video. Turn On by Mighty Flex. Yeah. Watch, look for me. <laughs> <laughs> it, you know, again, you, you showed a whole different range from the conscious, the fire in you, to the love side of you. Yeah, gotta have the love. Gotta have the love. That's Support true. You, you have to have love with fire. That's how you yeah, get that. Yeah, that's how you get that real yeah. whole circle, that connection. <laughs> yeah. I really want people to be able to follow you. You have a great talent, and the songs that you're writing, they have good message. So I really want you to give us your social media info. So oh, you follow you. You could, you could check me on uh, Facebook, mm-hmm. my Flex. Mighty Flex. Yeah. There you could go. Mighty Flex MF6. Okay. Yeah. That, that, um, that's my. Um, MF6, that's my. Uh, Instagram? In, Instagram. Instagram. Yes. Yeah, it's okay. my Instagram. My Instagram. Page. So you're on yeah. Facebook, Instagram, any place else we can find you? That's just my group, basically. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So Facebook and Instagram. Instagram. You could YouTube Mighty Flex, you get some of my videos. Okay. Any upcoming shows or where can we see you I got in, a sh- in the tri-state area? There is a show coming up. I got a show coming up in June. I think it's okay. uh, June 14th. Mm-hmm. It's at uh, Amarachi's downtown. Yeah. yeah. And so, uh, anything we can find noted on your page if we look yeah, it's on my, yeah. Okay. It's okay. also on my Instagram. Okay. You will see Amarachi Land. Well, you know, I, I know your time has been well spent here, but you know, before you leave, you definitely have to sit that song for me. Which song? You know what song. <laughs> <laughs> the song I told you was one of my favorites. Oh, um, that, uh, As We Rise. That's right. Uh, oh. Don't see it. As We Rise. As We oh. I'm sorry, don't play me. <laughs> as We Rise. As We Rise. As, yeah, yeah. That song there. Actually, it's me and the other Grenadian artists, Brightest Star. Mm. Yeah, sing that song. They reached out to me and heard about me, so you wanted yes. to do a song together. I, I like Same that song. Same Yeah. And really and truly, coming up the Grenada scene, regular music, it was like more like a struggle because you got to fight. It's like, it's a new thing. It's like nothing that they mm-hmm. are accustomed to. Mm-hmm. Doing into that, the way that we do it, it's nothing that they're yes. accustomed to. So it's, so you, so were, you were designed either to jab jab. Jab jab. You sing a regular music to them, it's like, oh, you, why do you want to be a Jamaican? No, it's not about even being a Jamaican. Yes. It's about that love for that regular music. Is that, like I said, it's a hard thing. It's a hard thing. Yeah, it's a hard yes. thing. So we come together, we did that song. Mm-hmm. That's how it, as we rise. As we rise. Say it prayer as we rise. Try and make it in a life, them not like you. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Every man has his ladder to climb. But still, I fight you. Yeah. Yes. You know, grand time every time. So you see what you could pray on your eyes. Mm-hmm. I'm just keep it moving. That's why I like that song. Yeah. Those lyrics. Mm-hmm. So you know, you can't just come on Simba and TV and just give me the lyrics. Oh. I, need, I need some. I need some of this. But 
I need some of this. <laughs> <laughs> This is this is my reflection. I'm say brightest and bigger yourself. If you don't want it, you know. To you, I try and I make it in a life. Yes, them no like you, and every man have him not a figure climb and still a fight you. But the most I can say and I every time. So what did I do? We just say a little prayer when we rise yeah. As you rise, oh yeah. Ready, we ready. Figo make a step, King Rastafari, him we shield. Yes, him we strike. And we put the shoulder to the wheel, cause everything in a Babylon get crushed and that we heal. But tell you this, your life it not easy. Every man of you fight to get a meal. And even when they smile, it make you weak, me, I tell you this. You got to mind who you want to deal with. And if I love that we say, and if I music, the fire it a go bless, and fi body red. From you don't like what we say, you see the fire it don't catch you. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, check it out, mighty flex. Yes. Yeah, man. It was an absolute pleasure having you here. It, 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 keep, same, same. Keep that same. music to, the, to that same level. Really enjoyed it. Well, I enjoyed being here too. It was great. Good vibes. Huh? <laughs> and so we just want to thank you all for tuning in. Don't forget Mighty Flex. Follow him on Facebook, on Instagram. Jai is life, love, and it's all we need. See you next week. One love. Show with Chubby S Entertainment.